Sri Lankans are used to waiting. They can spend hours lining up for access to basic services like fuel and gas. But this is different. Today they're lining up for tickets to Australia's cricket tour of the country. Really hard time to Sri Lanka, so, but uh, cricket is the solution. As Sri Lanka suffers through its worst financial crisis since independence more than 70 years ago. Shortages of food, cooking gas, fuel and medicine have left many struggling. I'm just down the road to where people have been buying tickets for the cricket and there is a real contrast here in how people are feeling. There's a lot of tension and frustration among these people who've been waiting for hours just to fill up their vehicles. And this is what Australian players were worried about in the lead up to this cricket tour, that they would be using crucial resources like fuel and power when Sri Lankans are clearly struggling. You get angry only, sir. You, don't, you can't explain it, so it's very hard for all the people. While some players have raised questions about the ethical implications of the tour, there is a positive spin. It's probably creating a lot of jobs in, in terms of um, vendors and things like that around the grounds. And I mean, just the overall economic impact will, will be really important of Australia being here. In the CBD, protesters continue to call for the president, Gautabair Rajapaksa, to resign. Leaders are not listening to us, so we kind of help, like, need help from the international community to solve this problem in Sri Lanka. They hope Australia's tour will bring much needed attention to their struggle. Avani Dias, ABC News, Colombo.